Hi guys, it's Taff. Welcome back to B17, the Mighty Eighth. Here we are. We're going to do a Squadron Commander series. Now, we did do a first run of the Squadron Commander um, about a week ago, but it's the I tried to add a few more mods, and it uh, it didn't like it basically. So I've moved the game over to my um, my gaming rig because it's been on my previous gaming rig, which is now my rendering rig. If you can follow that. Um, so I've just started a new game. Same thing with the. Um, same squad, etc. I've randomised the um, flight characteristics, etc. Um, but we've got the, the standard bomber file, so we've got uh, maximum effort, Liberty Bell, Memphis Bell, and all those guys. So uh, nothing, nothing that you're unfamiliar with. So what we're going to have to do is start again, which is no no great shakes to be honest, because we've only done one mission, and we can use that as a as a dry run through. So that's fine. So let's plan our mission. Right, we are. I think uh, I can't remember if I selected May or April. Let's just have a quick look. Well, what, what's the date? It's um, it's May, May the first. That's fine. Oops, sorry. Let's go back. Uh, resume game. Uh, right. So we're building up to D Day. Um, so we can start to look at ports and transportation as our major things to hit at the moment. So we've got the Sherbrooke Air Base and the Harbour which we hit last time. Um, but I'm wondering if we go for maybe the U-boat pen and the um, the Harbour at Brest like we have done in the past. I think that's what I'm going to go for. So I'm going to put the Harbour as the primary and the U-boat base as the secondary. Now uh, can we... See this is the problem. I don't want us to fly here then go fly out because that's what's going to happen. Um, unless we bomb it that way, which is not great. So let's bring this over here, um, and then we can do a uh, more of an odd approach. So nah. it's not ideal, uh, but. Mm, no, it's not ideal at all, is it? Um, right, we will go south because we'll avoid this. Oh no, that's the secondary, isn't it? Oh, we could, yeah, we could go south. We could take them both south to avoid the flak there. And then if we come over to skirt around that flak, hop over the channel. Oh, hang on. We'll go over the channel islands. So actually we can we can change this whoops let's change this a little bit more let's put that there let's bring those can we bring those a little bit no that, that's as far south as I'll go and then we'll hop over the channel islands and well we don't need to do that we'll go over the, go over there yes back to Deanthorpe okay so we're gonna come over over Cardiff my hometown Cardiff we down here through the flak uh, we'll possibly get some enemy fighters here and that's not too bad we've got 30,000 we're going to go at 30,000 are we I've set that one down to 28 so let's let's go for 25 uh, 25 or 26 26 as that was the easiest one to do now these two oh, I can't do those ones it's got to be this uh, no not that one no not that one Right, um, why can't I set that? Oh, I'll set that in the, uh, there you go, that one's, we'll be dropping down there, so 22,000 will be fine, 30,000, we'll drop that down to, uh, 26 we said, didn't we? Why isn't that plain ball? Go down, 26. There we go. Um, that one is 26. Those ones I can't change, which is a bit annoying. Nor them. Why won't they be edited? I'm not sure, actually. I haven't done this very often. Um, There we go. That's better. Okay, so that's our course. 
we probably don't need to go over South Wales, but we'll, we'll use that as a navigation aid because our navigators are going to be very poor. Uh, okay, so we are going for a harbour and a U-boat base, so we're going to need some quite penetrative um, weapons. Here we go, it's got some semi-armour piercing. Yeah, that's good. That's for the U-boat base, the, uh, the fortified concrete, and also the, uh, the key side. And we've got some anti-personnel cluster bombs to sort of take out some of the guys. Um, I'm wondering if we take um, 500 pounds of general purpose explosives instead. Keeps the same weight um, but we'll target the the, the, the equipment and the, the buildings rather than the people because um, I think there'll be more damage that way. Um, aircraft to fly the mission. Right. This is our usual guys. Let's take uh, maximum effort. It's going to be our lead plane and we'll stick with her. Uh, we'll take the Liberty Bell. We'll leave Memphis Bell because she can lead next time. Um, take Chow. We'll take every other one. There we go. So we've got Liberty Bell, Chow Hound, Guardian Angel, Target for tonight, and Bub are the bombers going out on the mission. Um, no intelligence. What we can do is set the recon photos. Uh, what I want to do, I want to reset those or send them out for these oil production facilities here, because I think this is what we're going to target next time. There's a V1 site, and that's a oil production facility. So we're going to target these oil production facilities around. Um, around uh, this town here uh, and that is going to be mission 2 probably which is fine great lovely um, so let's um, head out and uh, get the guys briefed and uh, ready to go okay no no recon film because obviously we haven't sent a, a a plane out the harbour the Euro base we got the yeah, yeah, yep. Yeah. 796 miles, fine. We're going to have two squadrons of P-38s. High priority for the Brest Harbour. Medium priority for the U-boat base, which is fine. Um, but we want to get the harbour to stop um, transportation of supplies. So let's go. Okay. Start engine. So I'll get these guys moving um, up in the air and uh, join me in a few minutes. We'll be heading to site or to, to, to target uh, in formation. So I'll see you in a few. Okay, we're just coming over the N, well, uh, southwest England. So this is what? Probably Exeter or, uh, or Plymouth here? I'm not sure really. Well, we're just going to keep an eye on the navigator so his um, his skills increase because he's been look, he's woeful. Oh, it's Plymouth. It's Plymouth. Okay, so uh, where exactly? We'll just come over this cloud and then we'll have a look for our shadows on the ground and we'll give it a rough idea where we are. Well, a better idea of where we are. Yeah, you are useless. There's no doubt in that. Right, okay, we're just going to come over that part. So we are, in fact, let's get, take manual control, so we'll um, increase his skill, theoretically. So we're coming over there. And the shadows are about to hit the water any minute now. Over, over that bit there. There we go, so that's where we are. Right. So hopefully he can keep us on track now. He's absolutely useless as a navigator, but um, yeah, he's uh, uh, it's his first mission, so we'll give him a bit of slack. But um, we need him to uh, skill up pretty quick. So just going through the planes, we've got maximum effort. We have Liberty Bell, um, Chow Hound, Guardian Angel. Uh, target for tonight, and is it Bub? Our, our four bombers tonight. So yes, or oh, six bombers tonight. So yeah, we'll we'll leave um, Southwest England now and um, head towards France. So I'll see you in a few. 
Okay, we're just about to make our final turn before the bomb run. Uh, the weather forecasts are very similar for both uh, both targets, being as they're next to each other. Um, so we're still gonna. The plan is still to go for the harbour. Where's the city? Of That's the city of Brest over there. You mean, yeah? Let's just check on the navigator, see how he's doing. He's got us just coming over the coast. And we are just coming over the coast, that's good. Oh, what ha Oh my god, what's happened? Uh, we've had a collision in the... Ah. Okay, the, 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 the little friends have um, crashed into each other. He's dropping his uh, fuel tanks. There's nothing to worry about, I think. Oh, here comes the flak. So we're just under 30,000 feet. Let's just go and have a look, see how the, uh, the bombardier is doing. It's not very good visibility, is it? Unfortunately, the flak's not too heavy, which is just as well, really, because there's not much you can do when you're on the bomb run, just sort of stay straight. Now, oops, that's got somebody moving right. He's slightly off target, so I'm going to take control. I'm going to go for there, uh, maybe a little bit over. Oh, somebody's drifting off. There we go. Who's injured? Um. Oh, that's what. That's rubbish. Hang on, let me get that again. Which I think he might have been right first time. Right, I'll just go and treat this guy at the back. Right. Oh yeah, he's copped a he's copped a flak hit there, isn't he? Is he okay? Yeah, slap him around the chops. That'll help. Oh, he doesn't look good. Oh, where's, the, where's he off? Bob Johnson, where are you off, mate? You're going to get on the gun. Oh, that, that's... Just, just go back on the radio. He's okay. He's all right. He just look at me. Okay, brilliant. Excellent. Right, coming over the target now, it's looking good. Somebody else is getting dizzy. Oh, the guy the other guy's just gone down now. Has he gone down again? No, it's the other one, isn't it? They're very vulnerable on the uh, on the waist. Oh yeah, they've taken some flak damage you can see. Right. How's it looking? Um, yes, we've got. Good, he's back up. We left. Ooh, this is not the best bomb run in the world. Okay, go. Bombs away.
Okay, so we're aiming for here. This is this is you can see our shadows coming in the background now. What have we got in the harbour? We've got oh two cargo ships, um three cargo ships, what appears to be some sort of destroyer. Uh or military, and oh look at that one. Can I can I zoom in on that? No. Some weird you know, some weird stuff's happening. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with that. Um Here we go. Well, that's not bad. That's not bad. We, we're taking out the ship. That one's damaged, and we're taking out this core of the harbour. Um, yeah, it's not brilliant, but it, it's not bad. Not bad. Yeah. Um, yeah. Well, yeah, the, this key side is out of out of action as well. Look, somebody must have been out. Of, somebody. Somebody. Somebody drop dropping back. Right. Let's just check on everyone. How is everyone? They're okay. Let's check on the other crews. So Liberty Bell. How's everyone with you? Fantastic. Brilliant. Whoa, Chow Hound. Jesus, you've taken some damage. Oh my god. Um Oh look! We've lost the front the oh, the two in the nose compartment. The navigator and the bombardier are dead. Who's Jeffrey? Oh and he's dead as well. He was the um We got three dead in Chow Hound. That's not good. Um, let's just make sure that the what guns are manned. Ah, oh. they must have taken. To the cock. Oh, I'm guessing something went into the uh, into the nose of the plane as well. Good God, they're poor buggers. There's not much we can do for them. Oh, fire on the tail. Oh, I don't know. Okay, uh, what we got? Oh my god, they've got a death. They've got the um, the radio operators down. He's been, he's been. The fire's out. Great. Okay. So that was the. For some reason, the bombardier has gone all the way back to uh, put the fire out, which is fine. Right now, you patch up the. Um... Good guy. Okay. So he's going to patch up the tail gunner. Good God. And target for tonight. They are okay. And finally, Bud. Bud or Bub is. Oh, they've lost someone as well. In the waste. He must have. Oh, he took a flat burst. Good God. There's some, so much death on this run. Right, how are they doing? Right, everyone's back up and working. Great stuff. So let's just do a quick now. We're just coming over this waterway here. Going down there. Let's just check with him. He knows where we are. Yeah, that's, that's, that's pretty much where we are. That's not too bad. Yeah, so we should be just coming next to this mount. This, this load of trees. I can't see our shadows. But yeah, we're not a million miles off, so he should have enough. Um, he's accurate enough to make us skirt around that flak, which would be great. Oh my god, I can't believe I've had so many fatalities. Oh my god, the poor Chowhound. Three fatalities, good god. What are you doing, mate? You're just wandering around now, stop it. Find a position and stay there. They don't need a navigator, um, because they can just follow the, uh, the rest. Have we got anyone in the tail? No, we haven't. So where is the tail gunner? He's he's here somewhere. Top turret. Who's the top turret? Is um, Dave Marsh. Right, Dave, go on your top turret. You know what? Wilbur, where are you? You are on the front gun, that's fine. Is he okay? No, he's dead, isn't he, Steve? I can't believe that. That's horrendous.
guess the flat shell probably went in there and exploded in the nose. Pilots are incredibly lucky. Right, okay, damn it, he's okay, he's alive, but he's um he's in bad shape and we can't do anything more with him. Uh Okay, not quite sure. I guess we, we hope that he'd be okay and stays there. It's not really the way to, ideal way of doing it, but and Bob, how are you doing? Um you've got this Thor Banks, who unfortunately has succumbed to his injuries. Okay, and the radio operator's just taken over the gun. That's fan that, that's great. Great work. Okay. So any minute now we should be taking a turn north. Literally any second now. There we go. Okay, we'll start heading north and uh Rejoin me when something else ex exciting. Oh, I was gonna say something exciting happens, but the next major event happens, so I'll well, uh, I'll see you in a few. Okay. Uh, okay, hang on. Before we do that, Chow Hound is well out of line. Chow Hound. Oh, good God. Chow Hound is um is not turning very well. She is severely damaged. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Jeez. This is scary. Huge damaged bombers making tight turns in formation. We're okay. We're okay. We've got a lightning dashing off there. There's no uh, no enemy people sighted. Okay, well we'll press on, and I'll see you in a few. Okay, we're coming over Southern England. They got just watching the Chow Hound. No, they're okay. Uh, so I think we've got Southampton and Portsmouth behind us. I haven't been keeping too much track on the uh, navigation as you can see. That's, yeah, Southampton and Portsmouth. Um, so we reckon we're just coming over this little town here, do we? We are, in fact. Uh... Alright, oh, no worries. I'm just trying to sort you out. I think we're here, actually. Well, that's that bit. So the, when we're just coming over this this bit of green. So that's that bit. We're just coming over this bit of green here. So I think we are. They are. Coming up to Raid Road and Rail. Road and Rail. Yes, there we are. Okay, excellent. We're back on course. So we'll just keep pushing on and home. I'm just going to do a quick check on everyone. They're okay. Liberty Bell. They're absolutely fine. Great. Chow Hound, who I'm really worried about. We've got the three fatalities. But they've, they've done okay. Fortunately, we didn't have any um, fight opposition on this one. Ah, oh, he didn't make it. The tail gunner, he didn't make it. Damn it. So, Guardian Angel's got two fatalities. Target for tonight. They're okay. And Bud has just got the one fatality as well. Good God. It hasn't been a great mission, has it? It looks like everyone's going to make... Well, every plane is going to make it back, should I say. But, um... Yeah. Chowhound's taking a hell of a pound. That's... Chowhound is never going to be ready for next time out, so um, yeah, we'll have to see how we go on that one. So we'll keep pressing on, and I'll see you at final approach. Oh, just flicked over. Chowhound seems to be in a little bit of bother. Um, she is. Can I? Oh God, can I? Can I help? Uh, I don't think so. 
she's going in, she's going in, she's going in, she's going in, maximum rudder. Oh no! I don't know what happened. Oh wait, wait, no, she's down, she's down. No, she's not, no, she's not, no, she's not. Get out, 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 get out. Oh, we can't, uh... Christ, hang on. We've got the engine spinning, but... Let's just try and switch them off then. There she goes. Oh! Somehow... Oh my god, you can see into the compartments. Um... I don't know what happened to Chahound, but... Uh, yeah, okay, well, it, Ch Chahound's... Um, I think Chahound's out for the count, to be honest. Target for tonight has landed. Who's this? This is Bob. Target for tonight's down. Uh, no, Guardian Angel, there's Chowhound. Got some planes above him. Okay, uh, Liberty Bell is still flying, and so is um, Maximum Effort. Okay, well, um,. I'll just make sure these guys get down. I have no idea what happened. Where did... Oh, there's... 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 Chowhound. Hound. Where's, where's the... Where's the airbase then? Must have just got... Did they run out of... Oh, there's the airbase. So they're short of the airbase. I don't know what happened there. Really weird. Uh, but yeah, we'll make sure these guys get down. Well, they, some of them seem to be alive, so I don't know. Weird. <laughs> okay, so we'll get these guys parked up and I'll see you in debriefing. Okay, hi guys, welcome back to debriefing. Let's just see how this reads. I can't imagine it's going to be that good. Right, 1st of May 1944, Brest Harbour attack, distance flown 868 miles. Bombers lost one, which is probably Chowhound. Well, it is Chowhound, we know that. Um, bombage estimate high. Or bomb damage estimate, should I say. So, confirmed the new kills. Friendly losses, one. Um, so, these are the guys. Fatal wound, fatal wound. Loads of fatal wounds. We knew about them anyway. Fatal wound, fatal... Wow. Okay, looks like the whole of the uh, Chowhound went down. Well, those of posthumous purple hearts being awarded, which is not good. So, Chowhound crashed in friend friendly territory, all killed in action. Even though that, mm, okay, they didn't they didn't make it out, unfortunately. Weird. I don't know what happened there. Um, but it must have been the damage. Uh, anyway, so we've lost the Chowhound, unfortunately. Um. Yeah, so if you're going to have a look at the bombers, uh, some maximum effort. She's not too badly damaged. No, nah, she's not too badly damaged. Um, let's have a look at her crew. So, so this is maximum effort. Now, these are the uh, minor skills they have, so this gives you a better idea of what they can do. And um, that's fine. Um, bomber mechanical file. <clears throat> maximum effort um, essential elevator right elevator hor horizontal stabilizer damage okay that's fine routine hours to fix parts needed three okay for the time parts hardly worth bothering with just a few pinholes okay that's fine uh, okay hardly worth it. okay fine yep let's get that signed off get her repaired. Um, crew replacement. Oh, this... What? What have I just done? I haven't just scrapped the plane, have I? Oh, you... What? Reign of Terror. Oh my god, I just scrapped the... 
Oh, what am I doing? I didn't read it properly. I just thought that was to sign off the repair. Oh, for love of God. Ah. Uh, great. Well done. Brilliant. Right, okay. Reign of Terror. Oh, I can't believe I just signed off a p perfectly good aircraft. Well, I'm not going to do that again. Oh, what an absolute idiot. There you go. That, don't, <laughs> don't do as I do. Ah. Uh, oh, okay. Okay. Anyway. So Liberty Bell's okay. Memphis Bell hasn't been out yet. Royal Flush, that's our replacement for Chow Hound. Mother and Country hasn't been out. Guardian Angel, she's okay. Eagles are out. I will go and have a look at the, well, I won't go and have a look at the medical, the not medical reports, the mechanical reports, because I might just sign off another more, few planes to scrap. Oh, I can't believe it. I just didn't read it. Just didn't read it, and I just signed it, because I saw a signature thing there. Ah, oh, what an absolute moron. Okay, so, well, we just consigned a perfectly good aircraft to the bin for no reason whatsoever. Um, but as I say, I, I haven't played this Squadron Commander and I didn't read that at all, which is a hell of a mistake to make. Um, so we won't be doing that again. We'll learn from that. Um, so, yeah, this has been our first in our new series of Squadron Commander for B-17, the Mighty Eighth. And we will try to get these crews as best as we can. We've already lost numerous um, guys um, on this one basic milk run it was supposed to be but it, it turned out not to be the flax quite um, deadly in this um, so yeah we, we've uh, we'll definitely have to learn from our mistakes and um, yeah step our game up to uh, keep these guys going so thanks for watching I hope you've enjoyed it and join me next time for mission two so I'll see you then mm -hmm.